How to use your words wisely. Whether you're talking to friends, family, or even strangers, the way you choose your words can make all the difference. So, let's get into it. Know your purpose. Why are you speaking or writing? Is it to inform, persuade, entertain, or maybe comfort someone? Knowing your goal will help you choose the right words and avoid misunderstandings. Next up, be clear and concise. You don't need fancy words to get your point across. In fact, simplicity often leads to clarity. The more straightforward your language, the easier it is for others to understand you. Another key point is to consider your audience. Whether you're talking to a child, a friend, or a co-worker, tailor your words to fit the situation and the person you're addressing. Speak in a way that resonates with them. Ever regret saying something in the heat of the moment? That's why it's so important to think before you speak. Taking a pause gives you time to choose your words carefully and avoid saying something you'll wish you hadn't. Speaking of words you won't regret, use positive language. Words have power, and positive words can inspire, uplift, and even change someone's day. Try to frame your message in a way that brings positivity. Now let's talk about tone. It's not just about what you say, but how you say it. Whether you're being friendly, assertive, or calm, your tone should match your intent and the situation. Avoid overloading with information. Less is often more. Stick to the essential points and avoid going off on tangents so your message doesn't get lost. Another thing to remember, listen actively. Wise words aren't just about what you say. They're also about understanding others. Listen to their perspective and you'll respond more thoughtfully. People appreciate honesty, so always be honest and authentic with your words. Speak from the heart and you'll build trust with those around you. And finally, reflect on your words. After a conversation or a big speech, think about how your words were received. Did they have the impact you wanted? Could you have communicated better? Reflection is key to improvement. Remember, words are powerful tools and using them wisely can make all the difference in your life and the lives of others. Now that we've covered the basics, I want to share a few quick tips on how to practice using your words wisely in everyday life. These are simple habits you can start today. First tip, practice active listening. Before you respond, really listen to what the other person is saying. This helps you understand their point of view and choose your words more thoughtfully. Remember, conversations are a two-way street. Tip number two, take a moment before responding, especially in text messages or emails. It's easy to fire off a quick reply, but taking a moment to think can save you from misunderstandings or sending something you didn't mean. Third tip, reflect on your conversations at the end of the day. Jot down what went well and what didn't. This helps you become more aware of how your words impact others and where you can improve. Tip number four, choose your battles. Not every situation requires you to speak up or correct someone. Sometimes it's wiser to let things go or wait for the right moment to address an issue. Save your words for when they really matter. Here's a bonus tip for those of you who want to practice mindful communication. Try writing out what you want to say first. Whether it's an important conversation or a heartfelt message, writing things down can help you organize your thoughts and choose your words more carefully. Now, if you ever feel like you've said the wrong thing, don't worry. We all make mistakes. The important part is to apologize sincerely and learn from the experience. Words have power, but so does humility and the willingness to make things right. And speaking of the power of words, here are some inspiring quotes to keep in mind as you work on using your words more wisely. The tongue has no bones, but it is strong enough to break a heart. So be careful with your words. Kind words can be short and easy to speak, but their echoes are truly endless. Mother Teresa the right word may be effective, but no word was ever as effective 
as a rightly timed pause. Mark Twain I hope these tips and quotes inspire you to be more mindful with your words. It's amazing how small changes in our communication can lead to big improvements in our relationships in daily life. Thanks again for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and share it with someone who could use a reminder to choose their words wisely. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more content like this. I appreciate each and every one of you. Until next time, take care and remember, the power of words is in your hands.